Hey guys, looking at Litecoin LTC against the USDT, against the Tether, and kind of trying to figure out what's going to happen here as Bitcoin's volatility is starting to increase. And we have a lot of downside potential with Bitcoin, possibly testing the 20-week moving average in the 45,046 range, uh, probably in the next week or two. And what I'm trying to figure out is where would be a good opportunity to buy if that did happen. And I'm noticing two different opportunities here. And I think one of them is probably a stronger one. And I think right here at the 238 range seems to have played really good, really good resistance in the past. And I believe it's going to play really good support as Bitcoin continues to drop and Litecoin obviously follows in its path. Now, saying that, there is also a possibility that it falls down to 210. If it falls down to 210, it will meet where this support line here is and this support trend line. This trend line goes back to November. And I believe this one really would hold. Like, I don't think it falls below this 210, 210 region, uh, no matter how far Bitcoin drops. I mean, and I say that, I'm saying, I say, I say, I'm sorry. If Bitcoin drops down to 35, yes, yeah, sure, it could fall down below this, but I don't think that's in the cards today. I think at most Bitcoin will test the 20 week moving average around 45, 46, and then bounce off of it. So I'm going to place a good spot to buy in the 238, 239 region, 240 region, and a great spot to buy if it gets down to 210. So maybe a good uh, thought process here would be to dollar cost average in at both of these points. And then you end up somewhere in the middle and you're super happy getting Litecoin at this point at 225. Uh, because I don't think it falls back down into this 165 region. I just I just can't see that happening. It would take something drastic with Bitcoin to happen. And I just don't think that's in the cards during. I mean, I, I still think the bull run cycle is still strong. I think this is just a pullback. I think people are taking profits as well as I believe all the new people in the market, the FUD right now is huge for them. And we, you know how it is when you're an emotional trader, when you're a new trader, you're emotional and you just get scared. And so if they start selling off, then we could see the 47 range, but I just don't think we go below that at this point because there's just going to be too many big buyers at the 47 range to, to kind of hold it there. So that's what I see happening with Litecoin. After this happens and after Bitcoin starts to rally again, I think we see the next, As you, I mean, see how we went in these trends here? I think we definitely see, I see another big bump coming and we could possibly test. Let me just see what this was real quick. Sorry guys, just... So this was a 100% increase in about 27 days. I think we could see that again. So let's say at the bare minimum, we go down to 208. The 100% would be around 416. And if it takes us a month to get there, I'm totally cool with that. So that's my take on Litecoin. I think Litecoin is gonna be a very strong, very strong coin over the next three to four months of this bull run. And I'm really bullish on it. So if you agree with this, I would love to hear that in the comments. If you don't agree with it, I would love to hear why in the comments. And please don't forget to follow and subscribe. And please remember this is not financial advice. This is just purely me looking at a chart and just talking about the patterns that I see. So I look forward to making my next video for you and good luck.